Hi YouTube and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm making a recipe by Anne Burrell. I figure why not? I've already done a couple on Chef Irvine, so why not Anne Burrell? This recipe is called fried rice with sunny side egg up. She calls it her hangover food. It's a Hawaiian based dish. So I am going to make one healthy swap, actually two healthy swaps. So the first one is I'm going to be using brown rice instead of white rice. And instead of using soy sauce, we're going to be using liquid aminos and you could also use coconut aminos. Stay tuned to watch the end of the video in which I'll do a taste test. And also, I will display the macros for the original recipe and the macros for the modified version, my version. So let's go ahead and get this recipe started. going to need one and a half cups of brown rice. We're going to cook the rice inside of the Instant Pot. I don't measure the water exactly for this, but you want to make sure that you're adding enough water to cover the rice. just going to turn your instant pot onto the rice setting and let it cook the rice. You're going to need one small white onion chopped, one medium carrot, one teaspoon of fresh ginger, four green onions, two cloves of garlic, mince, eight ounces of cooked ham. This is an uncured ham steak. So I'm gonna go ahead and add my oil. I'm using grapeseed oil. So I'm just gonna put in two tablespoons right now. Once I add the rice, I'm gonna add a couple more. Carrot. I'm going to cook it on medium high heat. After six or seven minutes, you're going to go ahead and add your scallions. Four cups of cooked rice and we're going to re return this to the heat on high. This is when I'm going to go ahead and add that extra oil. So originally I only put two tablespoons in. I'm going to put another two tablespoons in. So now what we're going to do is you're just going to give it a gentle stir. You don't want to over mix it at this point. Just want to let it sit on the stove for a good three to four minutes to allow the rice to crisp up and then you'll give it another little gentle stir and let it cook for another three to four minutes. You're going to need a medium sized bowl because now we're going to make the soy sauce. Liquid aminos, this is what I'm talking about. This is Bragg. You can use soy sauce if you want. You're going to need some rice vinegar and I'm not sure how to say this but you're gonna need some Asian chili this one is sambal olik I don't really don't know how to say it sorry but it's chill it's an Asian chili paste so we're gonna start with a fourth of a cup of the liquid aminos two tablespoons of the rice vinegar 
two tablespoons of the Asian chili. I'm eyeballing it. <laughs> bit of pepper. Salt. We're gonna go ahead and try the yummy dish. Holy crap, the egg yolk is still runny, which surprises me after the picture taking and all of that. Wow. Wow. This is so good. Can I just like stop this video recording right now and finish eating this before I give my opinion? No, seriously guys. This is really good. I'm I can't say I'm surprised because I'm sure Anne Burrell is an amazing chef. I'm surprised I made this. It's really good. It, there's a lot of salt from the ham, um, from the liquid aminos, even though it's supposed to be better than soy sauce. This is just really good, guys. Totally thumbs up. I love it. It's, it's fabulous. Definitely give it a five stars. It's amazing, what can I say? If you like this video, please like it, give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments, I'd love to hear them. Leave them down below. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. That way you can get future video updates. I do do two recipes a week. It's tough, but I'm making it through. And uh, yeah, so I'm gonna finish eating this. Amberelle, you get a thumbs up.